Hey, it's Ron from the PPF Academy. Yesterday, I received a package in the mail. I saw something on Facebook, uh, an advertisement on Facebook for a sprayer that you can attach to a tent keg. Um, now, I've built, I, <clears throat> I'm kind of a DIY guy, so I've always built my own kegs for, for myself and for our shop. This happens to be one of them here. They're pressurized, just like all the other uh, tent kegs or PPF kegs out there. And uh, uh, I found the electric pumps, the 12 volt electric pumps on Amazon and decided I would try my hand at building an electric spray keg, which I have successfully done. And it didn't cost a whole lot of money. By, by the time it's all said and done, it's maybe a hundred bucks. But uh, you have to source all the parts. Sometimes Amazon has them, sometimes they don't. You don't actually know what you're getting. And so this company here called Cobra uh, Tools, I believe it's Cobra Tools. I, pay, I actually paid for this, so this is not a sponsored thing, but um, uh, they had a Facebook ad for this electric spray kit. So uh, I ordered one. It was uh, $145 with free shipping. So that's my invoice there. Uh, came with some parts, came, comes with a little uh, pull tag <clears throat> to depressurize the tank and let you know that it can stay depressurized because this is electric. Um, and they threw in some nice little stickers and a squeegee and probably, I don't know if this is a, uh, yeah, this is a little uh, diagram and, and uh, instructions on their spray kit. There's extra parts in here too for hoses. <clears throat> but it pretty much comes all assembled. It has a quick release here, like an air hose would, and uh, has the little fitting that quick releases into it, and then you just put your, your attach your hose to it, basically, and inside is the sprayer, the electric sprayer, with all the fittings, which actually fits a lot nicer than the one that I put together, and then uh, comes with a battery pack, which you can find these on Amazon as well, and the plug-in, and it comes with a charger, if I can, can't get that back in there right now. The, the pack is really nice, so it comes with a, a charger on this pocket here, like so, and uh, so you can plug it in and charge it, and this just hangs on your, basically on your keg, so I'll pull this keg off of here, let me unhook it, and if you can tell, I'm not totally ready for all this. But we'll pull this keg off of here and set it up here so you would basically have a keg like this. Some of them have a big rubber ring around them and you can hang it off of that, but you just put it on here and hang it from that like so, and it's ready to go. The batteries typically last uh, a full day to two days on, on the kegs that I've built. Um, and, uh, so that's there. We'll uh, we'll plug this battery in here real quick. Uh, it's powered up. There's yeah, there's power to the battery, and uh, I'm not going to hook the hose up to it, but I'll just show you real quick this right here. And so this is your little air quick release, and you can hear the pump running. Oh, I guess I should plug it in the right way. To, huh. There we go. So the pumps, the pumps running. There's nothing in it, but I'll uh, I'll connect this here. Let me turn it off so I'm not spraying everything. There we go. All right. <clears throat> so it's connected to the keg. We'll uh, turn this on, and voila, we have water. Sprays pretty good. So for 145 bucks, um, you get basically the pouch, a battery, a charger, the pump, uh, some extra parts, some extra hose clamps, and this really nice little deal here to remind you to relieve the pressure in the keg or open the keg up so you can allow air into the keg. So the uh, the keg will pump water out. So anyway, it's Cobra Tools. If you want to get yourself one, um, look them up on the internet. 
I'll uh, provide uh, some type of a link in the comments of this video. And uh, uh, they work, work really well. We had this hooked up yesterday and we were spraying all kinds of stuff with it. So I wanted to show you how it comes in the box. Um, I, don't, I don't normally uh, post up stuff about equipment, but hey, this is worth posting, so.